Hi guys, this is Hannah Mix 4 and I'm going out um, kind of on a limb here because I'm doing a video where you can see me and I usually don't do that but this was something that was um, a little bit more personal and emotional that I wanted to share so I thought it would be more appropriate. Um, I was doing my photo shoot video which you can see if you go to my channel and click on my videos and it's um, Molly's photo shoot. And I was watching that video back, and I don't know if it was, like, the song that I picked and the pictures that I put in there, which the pictures I put in were even really my best pictures, but I was watching that video, and um, I got to one picture, and I was like, wow, I'm getting, it just hit me, I'm getting, like, really emotional, and this probably sounds weird, but the picture, um, that made me just it kind of just made me tear up a little was when I saw the picture of Samantha who's right here and she's wearing Emily's holiday dress and I was just kind of like wow all these memories like from my childhood came back to me because it's kind of like it's full circle um, when I was a little girl there were only four characters or four dolls there was Samantha, Molly, Kirsten, and Felicity. And now with Molly being archived soon, all those characters are going to be gone. And it's not like I'm upset. Like, we need to put characters, like, archive them so we can have new characters. But it was just kind of, like, the realization of Samantha, who was... When I was growing up, I would... And this may sound weird to equate Samantha as, like the leader are the essential, the face of Pleasant Company. Um, when you ordered Pleasant Company things back when I was a child, they would come in a box that looks sort of like this. This is a lid. It's one of the boxes, but that profile right there is Samantha. And that, like, was the logo of the company, and it would be on anybody's books. Like, it would be on Molly's books or Felicity's books. And that was the logo for Present Company. So Samantha always, to me, like, was a little bit above. That makes sense. Like, Kirsten and Molly, Felicity, any of the others. And to see Samantha, like, play, paying tribute to Molly in this video that I made by wearing one of Molly's collections dress, I just was kind of like, wow, it's, it, it's happening that she's going to be archive that these characters are going to be gone together like forever and Samantha was you know the first one to go and then after that picture there is another picture and it was Kit wearing Molly's school dress and then I was just I was already feeling emotional but then it really hit me like these are my girls my personal dolls um from like one of the very first to Kit, who is a newer girl, um, that was created in 2000, and they were all kind of paying tribute to Molly. And I know that this may sound weird, but I figured other adult collectors, or even AG collectors, might understand kind of where I was coming from, or understand my feelings. Um, and I just wanted to share that. Um, it's going to be a little bit sad without Molly. Because even when I was growing up, Molly's stories kind of stood out to me the most, like, vivid out of any of the historical characters. Um, like the scene in the first book when she doesn't want to eat the turnips because that's their only vegetable because it's the war and they can't be picky about food they eat. That stands out to me. Or when, um, in the summer story when she's at Camp Go On Again and she has to capture the flag and she puts, like, the can of worms down her shirt to swim across the lake, and she was scared to do it. Those memories just reverberate so much, like, back to my childhood. Like, I could totally see myself, like, being a Molly, um, and being whiny, and being, you know, not perfect, because that's part of what I love about Molly so much. Um, so to have... Samantha, who seemed to me like always like the perfect one, paying tribute to Molly. Um, it just would kind of touch me and it was kind of really special and I wanted to just do a video with these two 
girls, um, and then probably I decided for my 30th birthday I'm going to take Samantha and Molly with me to the AG store, and hopefully, um, if a little girl doesn't know who Samantha is, because I'll probably put her in a meat dress, um, maybe they'll ask and a new generation will know about or see a Samantha. So I hope um, that you enjoyed my story. Um, if you have a special memory or something that you want to share, feel free to share. Um, I'm going to do my reviews, like I said that I was going to do. Um, I just want to get a preview and like a photo shoot up, and then this video came, came unexpectedly because um, I just wanted to see if like other people were kind of feeling the same way. I know that some people may think that it's weird to get emotional over like a doll, but I've never been embarrassed that I like H E. I've never tried to hide it. Um, some people, they just don't understand, but I think it's important to be true to yourself, and, um, that's something that I want to teach my daughter, to always, um, be open with the way that you're feeling, and I was just feeling really something strong when I look back at those pictures, and I was just, I was shocked because, like, these aren't my best pictures I've ever taken, but they really, they mean something to me now, and it's really... It's special, and I'm going to look forward to sharing Molly's stories with my daughter when she's old enough, and even though Molly will be gone from the website, like her things won't be for sale, that Molly will always be very special to me, um, and I just wanted to share that with everyone, so feel free if you need, um, or if you have a request or you need a review of something, now that you've kind of seen my collection, I'll be doing reviews. Um, it's probably going to be like three or four outfits at a time, probably over the next couple of days, um, and reviews of the accessories and things that I have. So um, those should be some videos to hold you guys over. So please comment, request, subscribe if you like. Um, and I'll talk to you guys later. Thanks. Bye.